Hey hello guys welcome back to my channel my name is Sagar Prajapati and this video will be solving one of the important SQL question and the question is we are giving this uh, input we have one table called color you can say and here we have one column color and the rows are like GRB and then we have a output so the output should be like you know color 1 color 2 column and here you can see the color 1 having this GGRRBB and in color two column we are like you know we have like r b g b g r so what's happening over here if you can analyze this output and input then you can see it is actually printing the pairs you know like g is mapping with r right so it is printing r here and then g is mapping with b so we are printing here b so g r and g b likewise if i see uh, this R right so R is mapping with G and R is mapping with B but R is not mapping with with the same value called R right and if I uh, talk about this last value or last row that is B so B is mapping with G and B is mapping with R right but B is not mapping with B so we have to write a solution for it so uh, you know I have created a small table and I have also inserted the value so if I just you know try to print here select star from this color and if I want to show you the output or the data then you can see we have this GBR cool GRB sorry right now uh, we have to write a solution for it so what we can do actually uh, see it's a straightforward question we have here we have to use a cross join because with the help of cross join only we can you know uh, we can map we can we, we, we can map each row with the or with every row right like so what i can do i can write here select star from colors let's say alias a and here i will give cross join colors b cool here we do not need to pass any condition or any mapping condition cool so okay now what i'll do i'll write here b dot colors color right here as what i can do i can pass here color one comma uh, a dot color as color two cool so if i just run this then we'll see what is the output now you can see we have this output like g g g like g is mapping with g g is mapping with r g is mapping with b likewise r is mapping with g r is mapping with r and r is mapping with b so you can see over here that the uh, the you know the same value is also getting mapped right so we have to exclude that so what i can do i can put here one condition where a dot color is not equal to b dot color cool so if i just you know run this again then you will see we have this proper output like gg rb rr gb and bb is gr right so if you you know just um, uh, check this output then we have the correct output present over here so this is the way how we can actually uh, use a cross join with where condition problem right so in some of the interview the co interviewer can give you these type of questions also where they give just input and you have to find out the output without any description cool so i hope that you have liked this video if you do do like and share with your friends thank you bye bye